The following is a commercial presentation brought to you by Collectibles Guru. Hi, I'm Gary Ashburn, and I've been working in the world of collectibles and memorabilia for over 30 years. Here at the Collectibles Guru, we only bring you genuine and exclusive memorabilia from the worlds of sport, music, TV and film, heritage, and even more. Every item we bring you will come with a certificate of authenticity. It'll have our name, our address, our phone number. In other words, you can always contact us. And most important, we're a member of AFTAL, who are one of the top three autograph trade associations in the world. This means that every collectible item we bring you is guaranteed 100% genuine. So when we say an item is signed, we guarantee it is hand signed and not a printed or a facsimile signature. So if you're looking for a unique, unusual and highly collectible gift for yourself or for someone you love, then this is the place to be. Hello and a very warm welcome to Collectibles Guru. My name's Ben Mosby. Thanks for joining us for what is set to be another amazing show with it being fireworks season. We have got some fireworks for you tonight. Bang, bang. There we yeah. go, you've heard it more already. <laughs> it's the best you can do. Uh, we've got some amazing brand new items that are coming your way as well and some, well, some lenticular images. I mean, I didn't know either, but some lenticular images that you're going to absolutely love this evening. First time on the show uh, and to take us all through it, to explain everything on the show this evening, the one and only collectibles guru himself. Uh, it's Gazza, Gary Ashburn. How are you, it mate? Is. Good to see you, mate. Uh, good to see you. Hey. <laughs> Left handy one. Did you Le see that? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Uh, we've got new product on the show. You've got a new shirt on to celebrate as well. Yeah, and... this sort of um, silly shirt season, isn't it? I, I like I that. Don't know. Are you all right, is it? It looks okay. like you just come back off holiday. Yeah, I wish I had, but no. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, there, yeah, great to see you. And we have got some amazing items. You know, really stuff I've never seen. I hadn't seen until recently. I thought we've got to get them. Yeah. And at great prices. You know, one or two things, really, really good value. If you're looking for, you know, seasonal gifts or birthdays, anniversaries, all the things, love you, whatever, you know, you're going to love some of these and you're going to love the prices even more. I mean, we'll talk about these in more detail mm. in just a bit, but just have a look. We've got a selection. This is just a few of these uh, lenticular 3D frame photos that we're doing. Look at the Batman one. Batman turning into the Joker. These are oh, incredible. No, they're great, aren't they? They yes. are great. Yeah. I've never seen anything like it before in my life. Uh, and we'll be featuring lots of these over the course of the show. So shall we see what else you've uh, got up your sleeve yeah, tonight? Yeah, let's have a look. Shall we have a look? Have a look. Yeah, here it is, Batman. You saw that just now. There it is. That's the Batman um, Arkham. And it's the, uh, they're actually 12 by 10. They come in a special box frame. And as you say, it's a lenticular 3D photo image display. They look stunning. Mm. And look at that price. Ah. Another one of them, this is different. Nightmare on Elm Street, Freddy there. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. I'm sure that. Who is that? 12 by 10 there again. A, a very different one. These would be fabulous to make a collection, wouldn't they? This one, of course, from Star Wars, The Mandalorian. This is um, Grog, and you've got the 12. They're all 12 by 10. They're in a special box frame. But we've got a whole range of them. They look stunning. Mm. I think for the price, they're just incredible value. Then we had, this takes you back many years ago, that famous West End and, well, um, Americans, uh, what was it, the old, old play of West Side mm. Story and the movie later. This is actually a classic, and it's signed by Rita Marino, who actually played the key role in it. Another one for another key role, this is oh, Top Topol, Ol. who was in Fiddler on the Roof. Another, uh, you know, song was, if I was a rich man was in that yeah, one. Yeah, it was. <laughs> and so you've got a great image of him there and yeah. his genuine hand signed signature. All these signatures are genuinely hand signed. Then we have Bing Crosby. This is actually a song sheet. <laughs> That's an Irish l uh, lullaby. But it's actually signed on the front there by Bing Crosby himself. Comes mounted and everything. Great image. This one's actually 16 by 12. Then one of our favourite discs, this is Queen, it's done so well. These are the ones where very, very limited, literally less than single numbers nowadays, and there are no more. It's breaking free, it's a live recording, and it was done at a European exclusive. And then another one, same thing, this is Roxy Music, Songs for Europe, as you can see in the red vinyl, they're all coloured vinyl of some type. 
it. But they have proven really, really popular. And so few of those. The stock we have is the entire end of them. There are no more. Then another one of those great lenticular images is, of course, Darth Vader from Star Wars. And uh, wait till you see that. It is just phenomenal. You're going to love these. These are at a special price at the moment as well, so don't miss out on them. And then, of course, Game of Thrones. This is Fire and Blood. Uh, again, a, a, same idea. It's in the box, special box frame, and when you show that, it moves. The image changes with it. They really are fantastic, though. Yeah. You're going to love them. You will, and love those them. pictures don't do them just as wait till you see them moving on the set. That's yeah. when you'll be jumping in and grabbing these. And I think once you've seen one, potentially people are going to be buying a few of these. They're going to look great. Yeah, they're, they're, yeah that's right. They're yeah. gonna, they're, I'm sure you will because you build a collection or you know an area and you put light behind them or something. Mm. They look fantastic. Yeah, and of course, if you do buy multiples tonight, you've only got your one postage as well, which is uh, marvellous. Mm. Uh, if you want to uh, buy this evening, of course, you can free phone us 0800 2 2545402. Everything we're showing you on the show tonight, and indeed hundreds and hundreds of other items as well, are on the website collectiblesguru.com. Uh, close to a thousand items on the website now, which is just incredible. And we're starting strong tonight uh, with my absolute favourite, uh, James Bond 447903. Um, how brilliant is this? Sir Roger Moore, my name is Bond. <laughs> uh, a personally signed photo display uh, from Sir Rog. This is incredible. Well, that's from uh, the spy you love me yeah it, it is a great image it's um there he is i mean everybody with bond anyone all the actors who play bond yeah. there's a bigger big demand they all really want them in their role in bond mm. slightly different with uh, sir roger because of course he was big in the saint he did oh, the persuaders yeah. mm. so they all have their own cult following but bond is you know far and away so huge but it's a great image of him and hand signed I, we can actually tell you where this was signed and when it was signed but i think now we're down i think that might actually be the last one isn't it i know we haven't got very very few of Roger Moore uh, in fact any of the bonds they're very very hard now to get and uh, they, they sell immediately so again if you fancy yourself as a bit of a bond or you know someone who's a, a bond aficionado or big big fan can't go wrong with that yeah <coughs> Uh, that one, as I say, is from the, um, the spy, lovely Barbara Bark in that picture as well. It was um, Ringo Starr. Yeah, that's right. Wife, Ringo Starr's wife, yeah. wasn't it? And that was the first time that um, that Jaws appeared, of course, in the Bond movies. You met Richard Kill, didn't you? Yeah, yeah we did him. a show with him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He he's was, a nice guy. Yeah, he was a lovely he's guy. A giant of a man, really, wasn't he? Yeah. Yeah, he took a photo, you know, I mean, he's about seven foot, isn't yeah. he? I always remember when he we, he, he travelled on the train with me from London to the venue where the, the show was, you know, and, and one, one someone said to him, oh, you haven't got the normal teeth in, you know, and he goes, <laughs> no, I left them at home. <laughs> or, you know, something like that anyway. I left them in somebody's head. <laughs> but, and he went, did she believe they were really my teeth, you know? <laughs> but he was a lovely guy, right laugh. Yeah. yeah, he said on the set of the movie when he had to put those teeth in, it was quite painful to yeah, have them, have them in the was. whole time. But he, I know him and um, Roger Couldn't Moore. Couldn't a baguette for nice. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Could bite through a bar of uh, iron, but not yeah, a baguette. Yeah, eat an iron bar, yeah. not a baguette. <laughs> <laughs> but it was, if you read Roger Moore's books, it talks about how him and uh, Richard Keel in that movie were such good, such good friends. But like you said, I mean, Bond, such a massive franchise, been going on since, what, 1962. And we are the place, I think, if you <laughs> want to get a collection of Bond, on signatures because we've got the majority of them I think haven't we on the that's website. That's right. I mean do check the website as well. Um, we've got a whole James Bond section there. It's constantly changing. Oh there it is look. Yeah. As you can see loads of different images but don't delay on all of them because we do have very very low stocks on all of them and they go within you know what they're there one minute next minute they've gone. And do remember if you are new to these shows all of these signatures when we talk about uh, personally signed or hand signed, we guarantee that the actual celebrity has held that in their hand and genuinely signed it. So it's not printed, it's not a facsimile. We guarantee the uh, or an auto pen. We guarantee that the relevant celebrities, whoever it is, has actually hand signed them. And all that proof and all your authenticity, you get your certificate of authenticity from an AFTA or a UACC or a PDSA. They're all the official autograph associations 
brands around the world that are respected. You'll get a certificate from one of their dealers, which is telling you what it's all about. So don't delay. It really it makes, takes all the worry out of uh, buying autographs. Here, you know, they might not be the cheapest, but they're certainly going to be guaranteed that they're real. Really important when you're buying your autographs. Yeah, that is uh, such a brilliant image. And of course, the hand size signature of Sir Roger Moore, of course, is uh, sadly no longer with us. 447903 uh, is your item number if you want to grab that, that brilliant 12 by 10 framed and mounted photo display uh, signed by Sir Roger. 229.99 is the price. Don't forget you've got clear pay here on Collectibles Guru as well. So you can pay just 57.50 today plus your postage and that will be winging its way to you. And like we said, if you are a James Bond fan, do check out the website. Uh, I think we've pretty much got all the Bonds there and of, of course lots of the other characters with their signed memorabilia too. Um, from one big film fr franchise to another, uh, if you're a kid of the 80s, you'll love Back to the Future, 428563. Yeah, this is a brilliant um, piece signed by Michael J. Fox. <laughs> yeah, very few of these left. We managed to get, a, 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 we did have a, 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 you know, sort of double figures, but we're down now again just to a, a, the a last couple. Mm. And um, really popular and now really, really difficult signature to get. Michael J. Fox, I don't think he's allegedly in the best of health mm. anymore. So he doesn't do conventions anymore or anything like that. Massive demand for him and very, very, very difficult to get. What you've actually got here is like a photo Photo montage. You've got three photo montages or three three different photographs, and that is his genuine hand signed signature in the middle there. And then of course, you've got a plaque that honours his career in his name. And this is professionally framed and mounted. It's a big piece. This this is um, eighteen by twenty four and yeah. eighteen and a half, half by yeah. twenty four. It's a big piece, and it is professionally framed. In other words, it's an individually framed and manufactured and put together frame. It's not a sh just a ch you know a cheaper shop frame that is a beautifully sort of put together piece obviously it's a considered purchase but michael j fox very 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 rare the framing on that would be probably 100 100 pound parts yeah plus and it is very 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 rare and very big demand for anything with michael j fox that's signed yeah absolutely it's, it's just one of those movies isn't it we'll say one of those movies that it was a trilogy of course but one of those mm. movie franchises that has just been so so super popular and it seems to gather you know new fans all the time it's all, yeah. it always seems to be on tv and it's, it's such a great set of movies wasn't yeah, it? yeah that's right it was yeah they, they they're really really popular i mean again as i say it is a considered purchase but if you're looking for something special you know what that's real you know do have a think about that and of course you have got the uh, the clear pay that you can actually spread the payments out on a bit but don't miss out on that if you know someone who would love that as well we always say think about maybe you know a few of you putting together if you're buying for a gift or a special occasion two or three of you maybe put together or whatever it needs to buy some of these items because you'll find that the people when they get them the smile just their face lights up you know because <laughs> it's something you can't get where do you go to get it normally can't toddle down the ice street or the <laughs> shopping now <laughs> even walk or run if you want don't kind of get items like this can't just walk down the strand or wherever it is you live you know <laughs> so um these it is really rare to get these items so do make it you know if you want one of them don't delay yeah go quickly as well beautifully presented as guys were saying 428563 uh, it's michael j fox back to the future big size as well it's 18 and a half by 24 uh, framed photo display 699.99 or you've got those four clear pays as well so it is a great way to be able to spread the cost on this it's 175 pounds uh, today plus your postage and that's on its way to you and again, like Gaz was saying, maybe think about um, clubbing together with some friends to uh, to grab that for someone perhaps who's a massive fan of the uh, the film franchise or indeed just Michael J. Fox as a whole. 428563. All right, so the first of our premieres this evening. And do you know what? Once you've seen one of these, I think you're potentially going to buy many because they're absolutely brilliant. These lenticular 3D photo image displays. Look at this. Gaz, I mean... These are incredible. They are. They're marvellous. I mean, we, we I made a conscious effort to try and, you know, get some lines that are uh, a little bit uh, more affordable. Yeah. I mean, with, you know, festive occasions and stuff. And the way life is, life's not particularly easy at the moment with, you know, pressures on capital, whatever way you come from. So we thought, I saw these and I went, wow, they're amazing. These are at a special price at the moment. So don't delay if you see what some of these. I'm sure you're going to love them. There's a whole 
range of them across the cult sort of market, you know, the cult film and TV market. But I think they're brilliant. They come in their specially prepared own box frame. Mm. So the box frame and everything is made. And the image, as you can see, the lenticular image, as it moves, the image changes, you know. I remember when I was a kid, you used to get like, you used to get like trading cards occasionally. Oh, and yeah. you might get a set. And um, some of you, some of the more older people there, thank you, will remember, <laughs> you might get a special card in with a set that moves. And that's what basis of this, as far as I'm aware, is the same. Yeah. You know, and and they look brilliant. I think for the money, I couldn't believe it. You know, so it comes, and they're very light, they're very, you know, it's per specs. The frame is a, you know, pla uh, a sort of a per specs frame as well. But, I mean, they're made, they're well made, and, um, you know, they look brilliant. I think for the price, I think they're incredible. And we're going to give you the opportunity to build a whole collection of them, if you wish. You know, for £100, you can build a collection of these, you know, all different pick your like you know or even less than that depending on how many you want you know but um it, i think they look fantastic and i thought for the price they were an absolute snip and i reckon they'll absolutely fly i've had so many requests from people already saying oh yeah can i have one of these one of these one of these just when i explain them you know yeah and there's no sort of tv trickery here going on this is what the, the kind of um you know effect that you're going to appreciate and kind of how it's different to a, a hologram because a hologram images are, are sort of, you, you've got more depth and detail here with that lenticular image and the fact that it's like flipping between two uh, mm -hmm. different images I think is where the, the cleverness lies with this and how amazing you know in the case of Batman you've got Batman one side then it turns and you've got the Joker it, it's so clever and you don't have to I plug know. it in or anything do you because people are thinking no, have to plug no. this in or I mean obviously what? we've got it on a what, you know a, a, a lazy Susan as they call it you know but there it is you know you can get those very easily on, on online and places that mm -hmm. or, or just walking past it you'll still get the same effect it will move you know yeah and it's great you could look at it and you can think oh wow i'd love to turn the light off and put a load of them on in the house you know when Have you it. come in and see we you can, <laughs> they don't, don't glow in the dark no. i just spent turn the light on and everybody's moving and be like they're looking at you yeah. wouldn't they? but it's honestly like that it's like those uh, those um, pictures in the old haunted house movies where the yeah. eyes where the eyes move um uh, when i came and saw these first on the set i was like hang on a minute there's a picture of the jet oh no it's batman oh no it's the jet they're so clever yeah. depending on where you are and how you walk past and how you look at it that image changes and it's such a really really clever concept yeah. i think a lot of people are going to be jumping in for these i think show, they will they? i think they're great you know they really are great you know I mean they're very light they're easy to move around I mean obviously at the price you know the fr and as I say they do come in their own box frame already so they're it's literally ready to put out and display mm. uh, again these will fly I'm sure of it if you obviously want to get uh, this one we've got lots more on the show for you as well and just for three tenors uh, that I think is an absolute steal. Four eight three eight two seven is your item number. So it's Batman Arkham, twelve by ten. That framed lenticular three D photo image display, uh, and it's seven pounds fifty if you're using ClearPay. So you've got those four ClearPay payments just to split the cost a little bit uh, for you. Um, and again, particularly good if you are buying for a particular um, anniversary or birthday or maybe the festive season. These are going to be um, I think brilliant gifts and if you've liked the Batman Arkham then this next one I think you're probably also going to pop into your uh, cart as well 451778 this is the uh, Batman Gotham Protector look at that that's yeah. incredible I know it's phenomenal isn't it it is I always loved Batman because I you know obviously I grew up I remember the original TV series and that just astonished <laughs> but you know Adam West and Burt Ward, Burt Ward yeah. and it's like a lot of a lot of fans you know there's been so many people been involved with Batman but a lot of the fans really do love the they do love the um, going back to the original things but something like this I think is amazing I just can't believe that you could get something so different and so f I mean visual it's brilliant is it so as you say for for three tenors or 30 pounds you know I mean to, or, Penny less, actually. Yeah. But yeah, it's. I think they're great. And if if you know if it was um, there's a there are others with a link to this which coming up in the other shows as well. Mm. So you could build like for example, if you're a Batman fan, you could put three or four different Batman ones, you know, or Star Wars or yeah. whatever. So they look fantastic. They really do. And at the price, they're a snip. I love this as well. So you've obviously got uh, Batman almost like looking down on Gotham City. And you, if you look mm. as it turns, his eyes just 
slightly move. And yeah. then you've got the, the, the bat, single, uh, bat signal, which I suppose uh, Commissioner Gordon has sent up in the air. And you can mm. see that just moving around the sky there. That is so clever. Yeah. It's brilliant. And there is actually, if you're liking these, there's a subsection on the website. So if you go to collectiblesguru.com, uh, you click on TV and film, and then you click on 3D uh, photo displays, you'll find a whole host of these. And like you said, it covers off a lot of... Um, sort of classic movies and TV mm. and you've got, yeah. you've got a lot of different ranges. They're great, as you can see, and, and there are others. This is just the stepping stone, you know. So, yeah, there, there's some, you know, real classic cult TV and, you know, uh, AC, DC type stuff on this series. Mm. And, uh, you know, uh, uh, you know, uh, they're subjects, aren't they, that Star Wars and Batman, they're huge, you know. So I think these are going to be snapped up really, really quickly. So do get, if you, if you, you know, if you're interested or you know someone's going to love them, this is almost, without being rude, this is almost like a, for Christmas, it's like a stocking filler, isn't it? Yeah. It's, you know, it's a great item. You know, like, you know, with your kids, like I know with my grandkids and you fill them a stocking and you buy tiny things and, you know, you try and put a couple of decent things in among it, you know. Yeah. But I mean, if you're a fan, you know, even an, an adult, that would look, I wouldn't mind that in my stocking, you know what I mean? <laughs> there you go, there you go. <laughs> uh, I know what to get you in the uh, Secret Santa this year. Uh, uh, 451778. Yeah, yeah. That oh, is. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, oh, oh it's it on the phone. Uh, <laughs> it's Batham, uh, Batham Batman, Gotham Protector, uh, 12 by 10, that framed lenticular 3D photo image display. Again, you've got appreciate that we don't have enough of these to go around so if you like it make sure you get it snapped up sooner rather than later £29.99 is your price on that £7.50 is uh, all you pay if you're going down the easy pay route I just think these are absolutely brilliant and, yeah. and that one again as you say his eyes change his, yeah. as they look don't they? Yeah. Like, yeah and you can see like the, the, the Batman logo there just sort of moving mm through the sky of Gotham. Um, but if you like the previous one, the Arkham Batman, I think that one is definitely one to also pop into your basket as well. 451778. Mm. Seven, now, I've got to be honest, I might have to look away a little bit here because uh, here is uh, here's someone mm. who used to terrify me when I was a little bit younger, even more yeah. than Gazza. Uh, it just reminds me, I got lunch at the Mother in Laws this week, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so we won't be late, honest. <laughs> Don't be late. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Uh, you say the old ones. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, we keep trying. That's Gazza before he puts his makeup on for the show. Yeah, though, yeah that's <laughs> after I got it on. <laughs> <laughs> that's when I'm late home from the pub. I d in disguise. I, yeah. did, I didn't mean it. I got a costume on the way. <laughs> um, 486107. Uh, back to 1984 for the original movie. It was A Nightmare on Elm Street. Scared the, uh, scared the pants off me, did Freddy Krueger. Yeah, I bet he did. Yeah, he did me and all. Um, I've seen him at conventions as well. He's always oh, really, England. really popular. Yeah, the mm. actor Robert England, really popular. Mm. But, I mean, these days when you work out, you know, I'm not being rude, you know, a signed photograph and your day, your, your fare and your entrance, you're probably paying 100, 125 pounds, maybe more sometimes to get to places. A day out at a convention is not a cheap day out anymore. No. It's a wonderful experience. You know, I'm not knocking the conventions. Wonderful experience, you know, to actually go there and meet the, the the actors or actresses behind these wonderful characters but it's you need a few in the old spawn doodies i tell you you know but something like this at the price is is an amazing value isn't it yeah yeah you would have thought he'd brush his teeth before he had that uh, photo done wouldn't you really <laughs> well, dear, yeah. dear. But again how clever is that if you're just looking at i mean as i say it terrifies me but if you're looking at just uh, freddie's glove there you can see just the yeah. the knives moving the face sort of changes slightly um so very clever and again, this is one of those sort of cult movies, isn't it? A Nightmare on Elm Street. Oh, yeah. As you say, I couldn't watch it. I actually was watching it once late at night on my own, and I had to give up. I, Did you? I wouldn't go to bed for about. I went and slept all night with a light on, I mean. You know? <laughs> <laughs> I am a bit of a wimp with things like, whoa! Not a fan know. of the old horror movies. Uh, well, you know, I don't... Mo I think they're great, but, I mean, I, I certainly don't like watching them on my own, as long as I've got a pillow over my head for the... For the you know... <laughs> no, not over my head, sorry. I mean, hiding... <laughs> my eyes sorry but at the moment you know the first scary bits you know yeah if, if it's weepy i have to have a tissue and if it's frightening i have sort of a cushion, ah, cushion hide the eyes. It, go and i'd be on the sofa i go and i'd be on the sofa with a cat yeah, yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> uh, it's the same story again here, though. If you uh, you or someone you know is a big um, Nightmare on Elm Street fan or indeed just horror movies in general, uh, then this is going to be a really, really great piece to add to your collection. It's just so very different, isn't it, to anything that we've brought before? On these yeah, films. it is. I mean, I think I just can't, you know, the block, the price is just incredible. You know, mm. I can't believe that um, what you can get. As I say, if you just joined us, these come uh, in their own made box frame with all the you know obviously the, the lenticular or 3d images in there so they're already what you see is exactly what you get they're very light as well so they can go on a unit or wherever you want to put them but they're made specifically and ready for you to just display wherever you want them but they're very very light they're not you know they're not heavy it's a very light frame to make the images work properly but i think they're amazing at that price Incredible. Yeah, 486107. Again, all of these at 2999. And you've got your clear pay option as well. It's Freddy Krueger there, of course, uh, from a nightmare on Elm Street. Now, next up, let's have a look at something again. You know, you talk of uh, Batman, I think, being very, very popular. Star Wars, such a huge franchise. All the movies, all the spin offs, all the TV shows. Uh, Baby Yoda there in the uh, Mandalorian Grogu. Um, and again, it, it, it's the same sort of clever uh, display that you've got here. Yeah, it's great, isn't it? I mean, this is uh, Grogu is a, is a character that's Mandalorian, really popular anyway, isn't it? But uh, yeah, again, I think it's terrific. This, I think, will be really popular as well because you say as you look at it you can just it's, it's just changing before your eyes isn't it i think they're f fascinating and again if you're a star wars fan there's a few different ones you could build a collection just of star wars you know mm. so do check that website www.collectiblesguru.com because you'll see there's a whole section as uh, ben said of these on there and it will be added to all the time the biggest problem we need to be sure is we can keep getting them prior to you know like seasonal christmas and mm. things like that so if you see these you know thanksgiving all the different one birthday whatever it is the key things with something especially prices like these prices you don't hang around because it is a special and I would have thought as well, with. if you're, um, so say you are a, a Star Wars fan and you're, you know, you're building a collection, you're buying up lots of different pieces of memorabilia. I guess you're always kind of looking for the, the strange and unusual, aren't you? So yeah, like I would think tick, so. Tick, tick the box, wouldn't they? Yeah, that's right. I mean, if you are a collector of, of a subject, or, or, as you quite rightly say, you often want as many different items of you know, uh, uh, that relate to the character. So, mm. and even if you get really into it, you'll be surprised that people collect things like tea towels or, you know, pencils or anything. Yeah. You know, even what would be just because of like, you know, souvenir type stuff. But they get it because it all adds to the interest of the character. But a thing like this, for example, is definitely whoever gets this, any of these is going to put it pride of place in a key position and have people going, wow, where did you get that? You know? So it is. It, it, I think they look brilliant. I was stunned by them. And I think for the price, incredible value. Absolutely right. We have got a few more of them coming up later um, on the show for you. But like we said, if you want to check out the range that we've got currently, I'm thinking that these are going to be added to because they're going to be so popular. If you go to the website, collectiblesguru.com, then you go to TV and film, and then you've got your 3D uh, displays page. That will bring up the uh, range that we've got currently. You're going to see a few more of these, actually, on this show uh, live because as, as much as the images look great there on the website you're not going to really appreciate them in full until you see them spinning until you see mm. uh, that lenticular uh, display in action so if you want to jump in and grab yours 427 377 is the item number uh, and all of these at £29.99 for clear pay payments of just £7.50 um, as I say do check out the website because these are absolutely Phenomenal. We'll come back to the uh, lenticular displays in just a little while, but uh, mm. let's have a look at something which I know uh, Gaz is very excited about. Uh, this again, uh, first time on the show from a, uh, a classic film, uh, West Side Story. Yeah, when I was at school, we actually did a production of that, like for the parents' evening of West Side Story. Yeah, I was obviously one of the you know the slim and lithe little dancers. Oh, in the of background, course, yeah, you know. yeah, yeah. Actually, what it was, the, the girl who was, oh, I'd be careful, she might be watching, she was of a fuller figure. Right. So Name they had names. to have me as one of the dancers to catch her when they spun her around. 
things, you know, the cases. <laughs> but if you're watching, you did a marvellous job, Patsy. But anyway, here we are, you know. Rita Marino from West Side Story. She was the key character. But it's such an iconic and massive, massive film and mm. cult movie, isn't it, really? And, of course, as a stage play as well. I also saw it as a stage play in the States one day, you know, many years ago as well. So, um, yeah, it's, it's, I think it's, it's great, you know. But it, 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 it's something very unusual. Again, it's the first time I've ever had the opportunity to actually offer anything. This is another one that come from this couple of collections we've had. A, a guy who's a, a very, very um, well known, actually, uh, but say his name would be in trouble. But he has a huge music collection. He's a big name in the music industry. And he's just, you know, downsizing. He's at that age in his 80s. But he has like a, a massive collection, thousands. And we've managed to get a lot of these items at really keen prices. And we always offer them at whatever the market prices we get. We offer them on at whatever it is. So some of our prices can be much lower than you expected. Others may well to be honest be more but it's all based on the supply and demand at the time you get them these in effect are antiques they're, they're film antiques that you're getting with genuine signatures when they're signed and of course the price you know it could go if it's in an auction environment the price could go through the roof but a lot of these we try to be fair so I think that's a really good price for a piece of real little film and mm. you know music industry you know it, it, it's just huge wasn't it West Side Story yeah, it was. Everybody knows it and the songs mm, and that. Mm, yeah. yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Like you say, whether you've seen it on the uh, big screen, whether you've seen it in the uh, in the theatre, that is brilliant. And again, such a beautifully uh, presented piece and a nice clear signature. Mm. There is only one of these, though. That's the thing to say. Yeah. yeah. So you're going to have to be quick if you want to snap that up. Uh, 179.99 is the price there. Uh, £45, your first payment of four on clear pay. 495273 is your item number. Rita Moreno in West Side Story, personally signed, 16 by 12 mounted photo and signature display. Um, staying with the sort of uh, musicals next uh, with uh, with Topol. Uh, see, I've never really seen this movie. I, I only really know Topol from his uh, role that he played going back to Bond at the start of the uh, show. He was in um, For Your Eyes Only. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, Topol. But uh, th this was uh, a really, really big movie massive for him, wasn't movie. it? it put him... And he did the old dance show. Can't do the song, can we? But, you know, if, the, if, if I was a rich man... If I was a rich man yeah. and all that... Needle, 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 on, all that, oh, you know. I thought Topol was in and the room then for a second. <laughs> yeah. and, uh, but it's... <laughs> oh, oh, Daniel! Uh, yeah. That was brilliant. Just so I've you know, our, our lovely director, our lovely director Daniel, who doubles up as a comedian in the areas of Manchester and the Northwest. If you're lucky enough to see him build to appear, don't go. <laughs> <laughs> he just said, "I said we've got a very yeah, top yeah, of yeah. He just said, yeah. "More like topple over." Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was uh, quick, Daniel. Lovely, see what it's not very nice, though, is it? You know, lovely, gentle, I know. F little like figure. Unreal. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, lovely. I love him. Anyway, what, we, what we've got here, we've got a great image, a great image there uh, of Topo, a great artist image, and then you've got the image from the actual movie, and it's hand-signed by Topo himself, you know. And... Uh, Actually, I could do that dance on him later, laying down. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Oh, I can't do it, you know. I'd run Stop. after the end of the show, Daniel, if I were you. <laughs> yeah. Or lock yourself in the gallery. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's on form today, yeah. Oh, He's obviously dear. been on the biscuits last night. You know. <laughs> but, yeah, it's uh, it's a great... I've never seen one before. And, again, you know, it's, it's just really something different. And we try to bring you a good mix, a bit of real uh, traditional cultural, you know, film... Film, it's film memorabilia, isn't it? Really, yeah. and again, I, I believe there's only one of these. There is, couple, yeah, just you know? one, yeah, yeah. So, once it's gone, that is it. But it's a great place here, it is a great place to build a collection, yeah, absolutely yes. right. And, and again, isn't it nice if you've been, you know, watching the shows, maybe you've just joined us recently, or maybe you've been uh, watching from the start? We, we bring you uh, memorabilia from obviously current films, but then you know, going back in time a little bit, West Side Story, Fiddler on the Roof. Mm -hmm. It's nice, isn't it? If you are a serious film collector, yeah, to have it all is. These different I think because the thing is, if you're into these, if you know someone who loves this you know, a uh, particular production or it brings back a memory. That's the great thing about collecting. You don't have to be a serious collector. Some of these people will look at this and just think, oh, 
I remember we were on a date to see that, or I, you know, we, something happened. It was our wedding anniversary. It was when I proposed afterwards. It will mean so many, evoke so many mm. memories from these items, and that's what's so wonderful about collecting. It's a tip. It's a step back into your past, and you can look at that and you think, "Oh, I remember it. I remember it well," as mm. they say in the movie, you know. And I, that's what I think is so lovely about that. You'll know someone who that will really reach into their heartstrings and they would just love that as a great gift. Love the fact it's uh, sign that as well. Shalom, Topol. Yeah. Um, four, I'm still laughing at the gag, I've got to be honest. Uh, 484 <laughs> uh, oh. is your uh, item number. I'm also laughing as to uh, the fight that's probably going to happen after the show. <laughs> uh, 170, they won't really, they love each other really. 179.99 yeah. uh, is your price for that. £45 on clear pay. Uh, it's Topol Fiddler on the Roof, personally signed, uh, 16 by 12 mounted photo and signature display. The prices on these again uh, today are absolutely incredible. Mm. Uh, Topol 179.99 and Bing Crosby, come on, like one of the biggest um, sort of, you know, uh, singers and actors um, ever. And we're doing this for under £190. I know, it's great. As I say, we got them at a good price, so I like to pass the saving on to the, the collector. Yeah. As does the guy who's had this collection. He said, I'd much rather they go into the hands of somebody who's going to appreciate them, like I have in some cases over the last 50 years. Mm. This is actually a song sheet of That's an Irish Lullaby by uh, Going My Way, uh, by, uh, by Bing Crosby, as you can see, signed on the front mm. in Biro, yeah. which dates it with the time and makes you realise that that is real. If it was signed with a felt trip, you'd run a mile because they weren't around when he would have signed it. And it's got, yeah, best wishes being Crosby. It's a lovely piece, something very different. And maybe the song, you know, maybe with the Irish link, maybe the song, you know, would a, a, a appeal to somebody you know particularly. You might think, oh yeah, they used to sing that, you know. Me auntie Ethel sung that to me, or me auntie Reenie, you know, or, or it could or it could be Uncle Declan, couldn't it? it doesn't Uncle matter. Declan, yeah. Yeah, yeah. whatever it is. Yeah. Uh, don't think about it. Somebody says something cruel here. Do forgive me. Bing Crosby really had... He could have gone in Star Trek with them ears, couldn't he? <laughs> <Don't you think? laughs> Gary! <laughs> He'd have been, been lovely. No, he's a wonderful man. I love him to bits. I'm not being rude. It's about time I have to go at someone else. I'm loving to go at me. <laughs> but no, I and love you, you Bing. decide to have a go at Bing. <laughs> Unbelievable. Yeah. No, I'm not having to go at Bing. I love Bing. Bing Crosby and Bob Hope. I loved all their movies as well, you know, together. <laughs> and uh, I love seeing all this. It's like a step back in time, you know. So <laughs> it's wonderful. Yeah. But yeah, if you want a, a genuine and signed item that's something very different, imagine that in a frame in mm. your home, a part of a collection. It's going to really stand out. You know, we get photos they look wonderful but i love the items that are a bit different a little bit of you know sort of something just different that yeah. that ticks all the boxes every good wish there you go bing crosby i love the fact he's just elaborated a little bit and then you've got his signature there as well uh 189.99 487.999 is your uh, item number for that one and 47 pounds 50 if you're using Clear pay, so four payments there for you. Uh, next up, something which we're featuring a lot just because it is that sort of season and uh, if you're looking for a great gift to keep the, the kids or the grandkids quiet for a few hours, then look no further at a stunning price at Julesy's Puppet Theatre, 9 99 It's ridiculous. It's on a special offer at the moment. But basically, you get the theatre. You get a, a fold-up, eco-friendly fold-out theatre. You get those five lovely handmade um, puppets, finger puppets. Um, obviously, the theme of this is Little Red Riding Hood, because you can see Little Red Riding Hood, you've got the grandma, you've got the woodcutter, mm -hmm. and the two images of the wolf, the one when he's uh, doubling up, trying to pretend to be the grandma. But it's a wonderful piece. That hand is what they actually sit on when you're not using it, if you wish. But the theatre itself, the whole thing has been so wonderful it's achieved awards because it's very innovative it's very creative and it also it uh, the storyboard that comes with you can see the, the younger child there re or the child oh, yeah. reading the book that's like you get the storyboard of of uh you know of um 
Little Red Riding Hood come mad then. So they one of them can read the story while the younger children enact it on the stage. Okay. And then they will take turns. It's a great way to teach them to take turns, to play together. Mm. And an older child or a parent can read the book. But I know a lot of reception classes and nurseries have bought copies that have bought these, you know, because it's great. You can bring the whole class together and they will have a go. And, you know, there's a colouring sheet with it. It's a wonderful item. At that price, it's an absolute giveaway you know yeah it is and like you know as i said to you i, I uh, took one to my nieces and nephews last christmas and they absolutely loved it um and it was just nice seeing like kids playing like kids should play because i think you yeah. know, nowadays there's the tablets isn't there and the you know tv screens and kids have forgotten how to, how to play and use their imagination that's right well that's exactly what it is it encourages them to use their imagination no batteries no tablets no mobile phones no computers just good old-fashioned fun for the family yeah it's julesy's puppet theater little red riding hood it's a half price special uh, go quickly because uh, i know how popular these are 627295 pounds 50 if you want to use clear pay two pounds 50 i think that's the lowest clear pay price uh, I've, I've seen so uh, jump in and grab it the kids the grandkids uh, the nieces and nephews will absolutely love that all right let's have a look at um, something else which i think if you're a marvel fan you will absolutely love uh, 471280 this is brilliant uh, a hulk uh, montage signed by mark ruffalo yeah it's like the fist you know it's yeah. uh, it's an amazing beautifully framed and mounted put together again a, a professionally uh, handmade frame it's of high quality like you put on a piece of art yeah. beautifully put together and with his genuine hand signed signature it's it's an amazing piece it's it's a piece of art hang that on the wall and a gun everybody will go wow where did you get that you know they only have a, i think there's a couple or so of these left yeah once they're gone that's it we have no more but it's we try to get you different items but that's brilliant you know i think it's great and proven really really popular in the past yeah, it's uh, 471280, uh, hand signed by Mark Ruffalo, of course, who plays the Hulk in the uh, the Marvel Universe. Um, and light up as well, the light up hand and photo yeah. uh, montage display. That's incredible. Yeah, it's great. Mm. It really is a stunning item. Absolutely stunning, that. Uh, 449.99, on ClearPay, your first of four plus your postage. Uh, back to, though, um, the brand new items that we're bringing you on the show today. These lenticular uh, 3D photo image displays. If you've just joined us, oh, you've missed an absolute treat here. Uh, do check out the website. But these, look at that. Look at the movement that you yeah. achieve. I'm, I'm not going to get bored looking at these. This is brilliant. No, it's great, isn't it? There we all are at the. Uh, <laughs> that's the Christmas party. You know, see the food never turned up. We're no. all a bit thin there. You know, or me anyway. But yeah, it's, no. That serious note, they are. They're fantastic, aren't they? I think the way you look at them, as you say, even if they're, you know, it's not moving around. You still, as you walk by, the image could be, it follows you, doesn't it? Yeah. You know, it moves with you. So they're brilliant. Absolutely superb. I remember, if you if you didn't see the earlier part of the show these come in their own specially made box frame uh with the uh you know in, with perspex so they're very very light they're very very light easy to transport and you could put several together very very easily and they're not weighing loads so you could put them on a unit or wherever you want to display them or you can look around for like we have here with the you know the lazy susan where you can actually just like maybe have one of them or a couple of them turning around all the time yeah and it's, again this one's going to be popular because the Beetlejuice has got a cult following. I'm sure there's yeah. a um, there's a, a, a new movie in the uh, in the often as well. Yeah, uh, Michael Keaton reprising his role. So again, I think that's why this one will be popular because more people will be looking for Beetlejuice memorabilia. I'm sure you're right. Yeah, without doubt. Mm. Yeah, they look incredible. I think for the price, I think they're amazing absolutely amazing i mean we deliberately set out to try and find a few lines that you know with times are a bit tough and mm. you know seasonal greets coming up but you these are just almost it's almost like a, one of the the better items maybe for putting in a stocking isn't it yeah well like you said earlier on like you, t you know, sometimes with stockings you end up just putting stuff in there for the sake of it that's not that great no. uh, and you might be spending you know 15 20 25 30 pounds on something why not spend it on something like this which yeah. people are going to appreciate and something which you know people People might not have seen before because these yeah. are very very different no they're very new very different i mean i saw them you know i got i i, I saw them uh, displayed in a specialist uh, environment in a 
sort of shop, a specialist shop, yeah. and the amount of people, just everybody was just stopping and looking, and they had loads of stuff all over the walls, yeah. you know. But these were, uh, and they have some in bigger sizes, you know, we may later on bring along some bigger oh, okay. versions, you know. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, it's. I thought we'd try them with these, because I was just convinced that people would snap them up. But do remember, this is a special price, so I wouldn't hang around too long with these. Yeah, best to look at it as like a, like an introductory price, if you like, really, isn't yeah. it? 29.99 is the uh, price. 455604. How much fun. These are absolutely brilliant. Uh, £7.50 today if you're using Clearpay. So your first of four payments plus your postage. Uh, and again, do have a look. We've got a few more to feature before the end of the show, but there is a full listing for you on the website. So you go to collectiblesguru.com, go to TV and film, and you'll see the drop down for these um, lenticular photo displays. They're absolutely brilliant. And as you can see, uh, you know, across a, lots of different ranges of movies and sort of comic book heroes and uh, TV in there as well. Uh, but if you like the Beetlejuice one, it is 455604 um, at £7.50 on your clear pay today. Uh, next up, I'm loving seeing all of these uh, brand new to the show. The yeah. Matrix. Talk us around this one. Yeah, I know that again, they're just so, do you can just see them, the movement in them. I think they're incredible because, you know, it's such a small unit, really. I mean, they're 12 by 10 in size, um, but I, I, they're great, aren't they? And and when you look at them, you know, the the, the size, uh, the the images, the way they move, it's just fascinating, you know. Yeah. Absolutely. And I, I just really cannot believe the price, you know. So you, what are you going to get that's, that's so evocative, so different, so sort of, you know, it is a great, great item, perfect as a gift. Yeah. And again, look at this, like the depth and dimension that you get in these, which is so yeah. different to perhaps, you know, something you might have seen before, like a, like a hologram or a holographic image. You've got mm. more depth and dimension with these lenticular images. You've got that whole kind of like cityscape drop behind them. And yeah. um, you just got that feel of movement as it turns. And just to say again, like Gaz is saying, we've obviously set this up in the studio so that you get the, the sort of best effect, if you like, so you can see what you're buying. But there's, you don't have to put any batteries in this or anything or plug it in, do you? No, no, no. no. You could just really walk by and they move. You know, they, as you walk along, they, they'll follow you. The eyes, as you say, with some of the eyes will follow you. And you're like, ah! You know, <laughs> they are brilliant, you know. And it's... And it's be so easy look at that so easy to sort of build a collection for very very you know what is a very not being rude but a, a very small amount of money you could build a collection of them and this will be popular as well because the, the matrix franchise again mm. has been huge and there was um do you know what i've got to admit it's, it's one of those uh, movie franchises i've never i've never seen no. I've never seen it, but there, I think there was a new one out fairly recently as, as well, wasn't there? Um, so again, lots of people perhaps looking for yeah. uh, memorabilia from this from this franchise. Yeah, without doubt. But as I say, you know, they look brilliant. Whatever ones you like, or you know, whether it's one or you want to build a whole collection, I tell you what, whoever you buy them for, or even for yourself, treat yourself because you're going to love them for the bits. 477086, that is the Matrix Lightfall. Again, all of these 12 by 10 framed lenticular 3D photo image display, uh, £29.99 or £7.50 if you're using clear paint. Just looks so good. Um, and if, if you get nothing off this show today, at least you know and you've learned, as I have, all about lenticular. There you go. Yeah. You see, not only do we bring you the deals, but we're educational as well, guys. Yeah, right? without doubt. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you can even spell it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now, we featured um, a Star Wars um, lenticular image a little bit earlier on, which was kind of um, a little bit more up to date, The Mandalorian, of course, which has been a, a hugely successful um, a TV show. If you think of Star Wars, and perhaps for people perhaps who don't know a lot about Star Wars, if you ask them to name a character, I think they'd probably say Darth Vader, and that's who we've got next. Yeah, he was the... I mean, I think he he was built by the uh, all the original you know media stuff and hype as the ultimate villain. Mm. You know, I remember you know Dave Prowse who played the role in the original movies. A good friend, old Dave. Uh, yeah. miss him a lot. Sadly, no longer with us. But he was massive. Whenever he went to conventions, I've seen him in America and everywhere at conventions, and he is a massive draw because of the character he played. You know, I mean, obviously he's a nice guy. Was it? He was a really nice guy. But when you it, it, that character, if as you quite rightly said, if you, know, you said name someone from Star Wars. 
probably he's the first one that will come mm -hmm. up. Obviously, there's Chewbacca and there's so many, but he tends to be the most, the key character from Star Wars that people remember. Everybody wants something of Darth Vader. And again, of that, looking at how it changes, I think this will absolutely fly. Yeah. Absolutely fantastic, you know. If Dave was still around, I'd present him one of them because he'd love it. You know, he had a few pieces of, you know, honouring his role. But I could just see him giving him that. We're sitting there having his tea and biscuits. <laughs> yeah, mate, it, I bought you some. It's interesting you, know. you say that, but that must happen. I mean, well, you just said it does. For, for yeah. actors, perhaps, who have a particular role or been famous for it, they'd probably collect... You know, items of their own memorabilia. If you uh, like. Well, they do sometimes. Sometimes they get presented them. Yeah. It's curiosity. But if you put that in front of him, he, he, he had that broad Bristolian accent. Imagine, oh, that's all right. Where you get that from? I like that. You know, <laughs> <laughs> he was always like that. He was through old Dave. Yeah, a lovely guy, and his wife as well, Norma, mm. lovely person. But so uh, miss him loads. I think that um, image again just shows off uh, how lenticular is so different to holographic as well because you've got that sort of main large image haven't you and then as mm. it turns he's he got a smaller image with this lightsaber it's well incredible. that's right he's coming to get you, you know? yeah coming <laughs> yeah. to get you you're not coming to we get me we used to say with a voice we used to joke as well you know about his voice because obviously in the movies you've probably heard me tell the story about he wasn't most pleased when they dubbed his voice you know but i used to say can you imagine you know like uh, <laughs> he was gonna hold me you know i come with you my lightsaber <laughs> it doesn't have quite the, the the depth of the voice maybe they're associated with the character but dave you know, I don't have a like, I'd say that in front of David, he threatened to hit me with a lightsaber. <laughs> but he was, you know, we had some great fun, and um, but yeah, massive character. And for St Star Wars fans worldwide, they would love that absolutely yeah. love it. You know, I think uh, it's going to be very, very popular. That one in particular, uh, Darth Vader, uh, th uh, four, five, three, and eight, nine, four is your item number again, 12 by 10. Framed lenticular 3D photo image display. I think that one again particularly just shows off how brilliant these new displays are. And once again, you're only paying that price of $29.99. Great introductory price to this collection of amazing displays. Hopefully, something that sort of fits in with your line of collections. £7.50 is all you'll pay again today if you're using ClearPay. Uh, but any Star Wars fan, I'm sure, would absolutely love that. If you've got a Star Wars fan in your, um, in your life, whether it's uh, son, daughter, mum, dad, whoever it is, that's a great buy. And, and again, yeah. I think something very different to perhaps what they've already got in a collection. It's great Star Wars. It's one of those shows, when you go to a convention, you'll see like grandparents with grandchildren Move, you know, talk, talking about the, the event because it's so ageless, really. Yeah, and something which has proved uh, very popular, I suppose, over the last uh, dec or, decade or so. And again, one of those TV shows that I absolutely need to catch up on because I know so many people who've, who've seen it, watched it, loved it. Game of Thrones, uh, 427822. What have we got here? Yeah, yeah. Wow. Again, it, it's quite a frightening image. I'm the same as you. I never really watched Game of Thrones. You know, I was I had other things going on a bit in my life. Didn't really watch it. But everybody I know was, uh, you know, was raved about it. And it's massive, you know. And I've been at conventions where they've had the actors there. And they're huge. They're massive for them, you know. Yeah. Absolutely huge. And, um, you know, they'd be queuing for two or three hours sometimes just to get an image or a signed photograph. I mean, it was a huge success. Well, it's got that sort of cult okay. following now, hasn't it? Like yeah, Star Wars, massive. Harry Potter, yeah, all these movies. Huge. Absolutely huge. It really is. So, I mean, yeah, again, the Game of Thrones fans are, are going to adore that, aren't they? It's just, it's just a very very stunning and very reasonably priced way to buy yourself something that, uh, 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 that really brings it all alive in your own home. Absolutely, and look, look at the way, as that turns, you've got that uh, fire um, coming through on the top and the, uh, the bottom of the picture there once again, and you've got that rather ferocious looking uh, dragon in uh, 3D as well. It's incredible. Once again, we just don't have a huge amount of these. So, you know, if you've looked at any of these tonight, whether it's the Batman ones we featured earlier, whether it is the uh, the Beetlejuice one, maybe you uh, just had a, a quick look at this and you're loving it, jump in and go early, because I think at the sort of price that we're talking about here, 29.99, these will go very quickly. Uh, 427822, particularly for those people again, because I know we always sort of talk to, uh, you know, the collectors, but I know a lot of people watch us now and, uh, you know, perhaps are buying for somebody. Uh, if you if you know somebody who's a Game of Thrones uh, fanatic, Game of Thrones fan, this is 
perfect for them. And just, again, like I said, something a little bit different, perhaps what they might already have in their collection. Well, that's right. I mean, all of these franchises, if you know someone who's into it, it would be Star Wars, Batman, Beetlejuice, you know, uh, Game of Thrones that we're looking at here. They all, they're all going to be a, ma a great gift because there's something very different. They probably haven't seen it before either. And look at the price you're paying for it. it, it I think they're incredible. I'd be amazed if they don't fly out the door. Yeah, 427822 uh, for the Game of Thrones lenticular 3D photo image display. Fire and Blood Dragon, that one. Um, and these are all £7.50 on clear pay, first of four payments. More on the website, which I am sure you will see over the course of coming shows as well. But if you want to have a quick look as to the different ranges of these lenticular displays that we've got in stock, there you go. All you do is go to uh, collectiblesguru.com, click on the TV and film uh, drop down, and then you'll be able to find the list of your 3D poster displays. They're all brilliant and they're all absolutely stunning. Real head turners, these. They really, really are. Yeah. Uh, Right, back to music. Uh, we've got a few items to squeeze in uh, in the last five minutes. And we go back to our ever popular uh, disc displays. Uh, Rolling Stones here. Again, guys, I know we, we've got so many regular viewers, but for people who perhaps mm. are just tuning in for the first time, what have we got? Well, these are unique to this channel. Um, and this is what we've actually got. They're all a limited edition of 100. They're individually numbered. So whatever one you get, you'll be the only person in the world who will ever own that. Once the hundred have sold out, and many of them are heading that way already, um, they're not suddenly reproduced, so that is it. There's only ever a hundred. So very, very collectible. They're framed and mounted to a very high standard. You, this particular one, you've got the great platinum disc, just as the same as you'd have one that would, you know, was uh, uh, presented to get the woman mm. there, presented to the band themselves and everything. So you've got the huge disc, then you've got the the CD case, you've got the plaque, and you have that extra photograph of the band. So they're a great item. These are, are, are bigger than the normal ones. These actually are 24 inches by 20 inches. So really, really great. We, these have flown out the door, but in this format, they're unique to this channel and it's associates. So do not delay. If you fancy that or the Stones, I mean, a massive band, any Stones fan, look at that, would just adore that. They really would. Yeah, 354209. It's the Rolling Stones black and blue. And again, as with those um, lenticular displays that we had earlier on, we've got a great selection of these on the website. Uh, if you search uh, under music and then you go to disc displays, you'll see the full range for you there. But they, they prove very popular. And as we always talk about on the show, uh, buy one, you'll probably end up buying two, three, four, or five of these because they're very, very collectible. And they sure. look brilliant. They're stunning. They really do. Lots of bars, restaurants, you know, mm. businesses buy them, as well as many people who, once they've got them, they just build a whole collection around the home or the business. Yeah, they're, they're all at 249.99. So featuring obviously black and blue there, but you can see the full catalogue that we've got on the website and you can split the cost on Clearpay. 62.50 is all you pay your first payment of four. Right, next up, again, these have proved so popular when we featured these on previous Collectible Guru shows. Um, vinyl's very much kind of back in, isn't it? Lots of people searching for vinyl, but particularly the vinyls that we bring to you here, uh, very, very collectible, these, aren't they? Yeah, the, the, these originally are, are deemed... Um they're European exclusives. So obviously the people in America and the Far East and wherever have gone looking for these in a big way. In the series, they're all their actual live gigs that were broadcast on the radio in various countries around the world. So all the royalties have been covered and everything else. And so they're, they're, they're and then they've been reproduced as a live gig onto the special uh, vinyl. Mm. All of them are in different coloured vinyl to make them, because they're aimed at collectors and stuff. Most of them never see the turntable. They will yeah. be on display somewhere, you know. So quite a few people have bought two because they'll have one to play and one to display. A lot of them are framed up. But the ones we've got, all, all the ones that are left now is the end of the range. There are no more. Can't buy any more. We managed to squeeze a few more out, but <laughs> there literally are no more of any of them in the range. So have a look at the website. There's a whole range of different ones. But Roxy Music proven very, very popular. Grab it quick because it's down to the bones. Yeah, it is. There's only a few of these. And I remember when uh, you know we first sort of got these discs in stock and I was sort of, oh, yeah, you know, definitely get one to play, one to display. You're going to be lucky now uh, <coughs> to be able to pick up a couple 
because we've got that few of these left. Uh, it's Roxy Music Songs for Europe, 394827. And if you do want to know the track listings, by the way, you've got Angel Eyes, Out of the Blue, A Song for Europe and Trash on uh, side one, and then Still Falls the Rain, Ain't That So, and Stronger Through the Years on side two. Uh, recorded live in Denver, Colorado in 1979. <laughs> yeah. um, and you can see again a whole selection of these on the website. Uh, music and then vinyl discs and you can see there already uh, some of these out of stock and we've already started featuring these on sort of recent shows so again do have a look through lots of decades and lots of different um, genres of music you've covered here as yeah well, I mean, if you look at what you're paying for remastered vinyl now when you work out these these were originally only four or five hundred have ever produced so that's how hard to get uh, 394 827 59 is the price on these and of course you can split the cost four ways as well one final item to show you uh, from that same sort of range and this time it's Queen Gaza yeah so exactly the same idea a European exclusive never available or anywhere else We're, we had a few you know we probably got a hundred or so originally brought into the UK and these are now with Queen I think we're down to literally the last single numbers yeah. and the last few once they're gone there are no more Queen massive aren't they this again is a live uh it's a live concert or a live broadcast of a live gig and uh, this particular one i think was in brazil actually but it's a live gig and it comes um this one's on the uh the what they call the gold vinyl and it is really really collectible many queen fans trouble is many queen fans have bought two of these so you know they're framing one up and, and actually playing one so if you want a queen really do not wait even a moment because we're down to the last attack yeah, handful. literally a handful. Three nine nine four eight three. That's Queen breaking free at uh, fifteen pounds uh, as your first payment of four on Clearpay. What a show! We're done and dusted. Thanks, yeah, guys. Yeah, cheers, mate. Good yeah. to see you. Great to see you at all. See you soon. Yeah. Thanks for watching, bye. everybody. We'll see you again uh, next week, same time, same place. Until then, bye for now. You've been watching a commercial presentation brought to you by Collectibles Guru.